Love is sometimes something you find, as Matthew and McKenna did, but love is also something you make, something you build over the course of a lifetime. So none of us can be surprised to find that we're here today witnessing their solemn promises to each other and celebrating with them. This time, they get to do it surrounded by at least some of the family and friends that they love and who love them. I don't think McKenna was looking for Matthew, either generally or specifically, when she set out to travel the world through the lens of a horse. And I don't know whether Matthew was looking for or expecting McKenna to come into his life, which he did. I do know that from the time they met, they haven't been very far from each other's minds, even though they've been far apart geographically. loved you in Africa and in America, in sickness and in health, and in fits of asthmatic rage and fits of laughter. I promise to take you as you are, loving who you are now and who you grow to be. I won't ever forget that you moved. Halfway across the world just to be with me. Marriage is the promise of a lifelong union, physically, intellectually, and emotionally. It requires mature, hard work, nurture, tolerance, forbearance, and forgiveness. But it pays good dividends. So I gave you this ring, not as a symbol of honor or obedience. I give it to you as an offering, as a symbol of my unending love and wonder, and as a reminder of the invitation. I affirm that I decide today to renew my love for you at every cycle of our journey throughout our life. Promise to end all the hard times of the joke, as I never want to leave you in tears. As they exchange wedding vows, each of them is holding an oathing stone. This is a derived from an ancient Celtic tradition that holds that any oath made near water or near a stone or on a stone is stronger and more binding. Matthew and McKenna hope that as they exchange their vows, each of you will hold the blessing stone tightly in your hand and reflect on your wishes for their future. My honor to pronounce you still husband and wife. <laughs> Propose a toast here to the newly married, remarried couple. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers.